Welcome back to Star Sector, folks. We had a tough, tough, tough uh, battle last time, which gave us a character point. So we are going to upgrade here for plus 50% weapons hit points. And our guys got some level ups as well, some of them at least. Well, one of them. Uh, we'll do power grid modulation because I want that for him. And we got a couple of new ships. Uh, we, we lost the EOS, but we got it back in the same condition as it was in before. So that's fine. Then we got this uh, combat carrier, uh, which has structural damage and an erratic fuel injector, which I don't exactly like. But it has eight fighter bays. Eight. Count them. Eight. And then... We have the BT2 class blaster cruiser that we also got, but we're gonna have to mothball some stuff. Uh, so we'll mothball the two of you. Oh, not suspend repair, mothball. And you come back up here where you belong. Uh, I'll leave those those two down here for now. We are getting to the limit of our ship uh, capacity. Let's see, five, ten, fifteen. 20, 25, 29, so we can basically get one more ship. But that just means that, for instance, we need to upgrade our two tankers to a bigger one, uh, maybe get rid of one of the salvage uh, rigs. Um, we have, do have a quite large tanker here with a fuel capacity of 2,500. So I think maybe we don't really need these two, actually. Uh, so that would free up two slots. Then we could get rid of uh, some of the smaller ships like the Omen, the this guy, what's that, uh, Silica, the Katora, uh, these guys, uh, this guy, this guy, the Badger, which we never use. I'll upgrade this to a bigger carrier at some point or just get rid of it. So yeah. Anyway. Uh, one thing that did happen that is very interesting uh, in the time that I recorded uh, or I didn't record was that uh, where is it uh, there Tartarus Sylphan R&D took Tartarus which is really nice uh, that was in between last episode and the episode before so Sylphan R&D now has two uh, areas. We have Tardisus down here, and we have, uh, up here in Rothkale, we have Castrum. So that's quite nice. And of course, we have, over here, we have, in our own Norse coalition, we have Odin and Freya, which are still uh, building, uh, being built up. So... We need to go find some places where we can get some crew and stuff. Now, it's very new that Tardisus was taken by Sylphan R&D, so I don't think they have much yet. Uh, so we're going to try and find somewhere else. Now, uh, the Solomika Yun, how we're neutral, so we could head to them. Uh, go to system map. Uh, let's head up here to Paramoni, Paramohi. There's something out here. What's that? Oh, Freeport. Okay. Pair of ships. So we didn't need to go that far. All right, let's sort this. Uh, 12, that's not great, but we'll sell it anyway. Yeah, we will sell it on the black market, though. Do that with those as well. Uh, and that's all that we have that we want to sell, really. Now, crew-wise, let's get some crew. We don't need... Well, we could do with some more supplies. Uh, on the open market, we can get some more crew. Still not enough. We'll get it anyway. Why are you okay? 
Let's have a look at their ships. Nothing that I really want. Uh, no and no. All right. In that case, uh, let's open the com directory. Just a base commander. Uh, no. All right. Let's head up to Nikolaev then. We're gonna have to dodge the sun. Or the star, however you want to look at it. What's this? Alright, Corsairs. Don't really care. Push this out here. Minor equipment cache. I guess we'll explore that. Uh, Omen class frigate blueprint. Okay, nice. Uh, missile blueprint package. All right, we'll learn that. And we'll check everything. Oh, there's a debris field. Uh, high risk. Never mind. Great goods. Uh, let's have a look at our fleet and unmothball these guys so that we can get the crew that we need. I think we'll take it up to around 3,000. There. Uh, we might as well do black market, right? Oh, that was um, that was Marines. Never mind. We want the crew and I suppose we'll take a bit of supplies. Sell that. Sell that. Okay. Let's have a look at their uh, ships. Anything we want? Uh, not here. And not really here. No. Nope. But I do think I want to sell. Let's sell this. But still, I'd love to know, does the salvage rate bonus stack? I don't know. But I, I'd like to know, so if you know, let me know. And we'll sell this. And that gives us a couple more slots for uh, ships. We need to refit these guys, but I don't think we can really do that yet. We need to go home uh, to do that, I think. Because we have all the weapons back home. So I think that's where we're heading now. Uh, let's first open the comm directory. Mercenary officer. Depends what can you do. Cautious. He is a wing commander. Don't so much mind a cautious carrier guy. Let's offer to hire him. Sounds good. Mm. You don't happen to have anything for us? No. Well, and never mind. All right, let's leave. Uh, let's just have a look at bounties. That's too far away and way, way, way too overpowered for us. Now that could be doable. That is doable, but it's kind of in the wrong direction because we're heading over here. Yeah, we're heading home. We could, let's just check out Tardis's on the way.
He really wants to scan me. <laughs> what do we have here? A Colossus freighter. Let's have a look at it. Okay. Where are you going? He still wants to scan me? Out here in nowhere? Oh, way station at Freya complete. Patrol HQ started. Okay. Tri-Attack? Looks like Tri-Attack. Okay. Uh, let's sell that. Sell those two. Okay. Yeah, they don't have much yet. Let's just see. Do they have anything to buy? No. No. Alright. Uh, Leave. All right, uh, we are heading to Alpha Dnieper. Uh, tons of fuel. We have good supplies. We have decent money. So that's all good. Pirate activity at Alpha Dnieper, so it's good that we're heading out there. Now, I did hire an agent, though I haven't really tried anything with, with him yet. Uh, let's see, we want to head down here. And to Odin. Okay. Uh, storage. Store everything up. Let's go. Okay. Confirm. Uh, let's just take a quick look at the colony here. We're building refining now. Uh, I think I want to give it some growth incentives. That's maybe a bit much. Let's just do that. And if we take a look here, Freya... You could do with some growth incentives as well. You're building the patrol HQ. All good. All right, fleet. You guys need to be refit. So let's do that. We'll start with the beamer here. And I think we should, uh, okay, can't do that. I wanted to just change the the front two the, to NC, not coalition, but I can't do that. Uh, okay, Sino Warfare Design, what's that? RM uses ships that were originally created for the third assembly of Tobin Cult to defend themselves against a non-human menace. Uh, such their designs do not entirely respect the edges of more conventional navies. Heavy broadsides. Uh, the ships get slower and less maneuverable for each slot left empty or undersized asymmetrically up to a 50% loss. Okay. The third, uh, beam weapons cost an extra 3 
op to install. Uh, that's the point. Defense weapon installation has been made easier, giving them a minus two cost reduction. Okay. Weird. And has system flux conduits and unstable injector. Structural damage. I think we will uh, strip it. And we'll strip you too. And let's start with you. You need some um, let's uh, inventory because all of this got stuffed in here. Confirm. All right. Point defense. Uh, first PD lasers. This is also a first PD laser. Then we have these six medium energies. All of this up here, I think, is point defense as well. ERPD, 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 ERPD. Oh, I, I'm out. I thought I had more. Guess not. Uh, then let's see. Uh, right, plasma driver. Sure, why not? Mm. Now, do we want this to be long or short range? What's the whole like? 5400. What would it cost to restore it? 172,000. Nah. Uh, we do need uh, integrated targeting unit. What kind of speed does it have? Uh, eight. I suppose that's fine because you are an. You're actually in nine, eight, eight. So eight is fine. So you don't need that. And what's your shield arc? 180. Can we do extended shields? We can. That's to 240. Right, let's do these medium energies. We basically want preferably six of the same. Hmm. Medium energy, a hundred percent worth it versus everything. That seems good. And it had a range of 850. So phase lances, no. Want a range of around 800. Machete multi roll laser. That seems pretty good. All right, so what we're gonna do. I think we, we have enough point defense. So we're going to put a couple of these on. The squirrel projectors. And then we are going to put a couple of these machete multi roll lasers on. Maybe a couple more of the school projectors. They seem pretty solid. And for this synergy, um, I'm thinking some guided missiles of some sort. Uh, 
Mm. Partially laser targeted missile battery. Mm. Mm. Typhoon. No. Harpoons. Harpoons. And then we definitely need to get these guys up. So something like that. That seems reasonable to me. Alright, so that's one of them outfitted. Oh, we're missing a medium synergy. Uh, what do we want for that? Let's just take these down. I think I'll do harpoons again. Something like that. All right. It's not going to be great on flux, but it is what it is. All right. So wisdom fighters are built in. They pack a hell of a punch, it says. Uh, decor flare launcher. Uh, so, and one choir meter and one swarmer SRM launcher. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Uh, let's see. Your speed is probably crap, right? Seven. So you definitely need uh, augmented drive field. And we're going to give you the integrating targeting unit as well. And maybe, uh, do we have... Looking for the expanded deck crew. Uh, I think we'll go with that as well. All right, so what do we have here? We have small energy, medium energy. Uh, we have small syner uh, medium synergies. We have a lot of small missiles. Small energies. Small energy, small energy. Okay. Well, the fighters are... Or the, uh, yeah, the fighters and bombers are really what's interesting here. So... The Warhammer is actually quite nice. Hmm. Wancer. Light Banish Speed Plover Rack. Uh, hmm. Problem is, I don't know half of these weapons and I don't know. <laughs> uh, No, no, the weapons either. So the, I don't know the weapons. I don't know the fighters. I do like gladiuses. We have so many, but we do have more wisdoms. We have one more wisdom. So let let's stick a wisdom in there. So we have three of those. Where it go? Where it go? Wisdom, 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 wisdom. There. Okay, and wisdoms are. Yeah. They're interceptors, so fighters. Alright, Mitya bombers, what do you have? One PD laser, two mag bombs. Hmm. Hmm. 
living battle platform. One thumper, one light assault gun, integrated point defense AI. Okay. Hmm. Lack of mobility for a gunship. Hmm. 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 I think we'll take two of those. But I do want some bombers. Superior, space superiority fighter. Hmm. hmm. The problem is, uh, it looks like we, we don't have that much to work with. Hmm. Overclock dagger rocket bomber. One annihilator rocket pod. Okay, so what if we went with that? I think we'll try and go with that. Small energy turrets, we need... Uh, uh, how many more do we have? Okay. See, that already takes us up to 217 of 330. And I have a lot of slots to fill out. So we might have to go with some cheaper fighters or just some cheaper weapons here. Uh, I want this to be long range. Long range, so minimum a thousand. Let's say there's nothing down there with a thousand range. Tactical lasers, but that's they fit on a small one, right? Yeah, they do. <sighs> what else do we have though with a thousand? Heavy shock beam. Ion beam, graviton beam, that's medium energy, doesn't do that much damage though. Medium combat laser, that's better, we have six of those. Heavy mining laser, well that, the medium combat laser is just better, so we'll Whoops, do that. Look at that. Then graviton beams are peeling. We do have medium, two more medium combat lasers. Suppose we might have to put some tech lasers on there. Let's put, let's put two more of these on. Man. Hmm. You know what? Let's take the expanded deck crew off. That gives us 20 more. A 
I'm considering taking the augmented drive wheel off. Because its main function is sending out fighters. So if we do that, then we can get... Some graviton beams on there. Medium synergy. I'm thinking harpoons. I'm thinking harpoons. Uh, hmm. Light kinetic support missiles. Hmm. Harpoons are cheaper, which I like. What, how much are harpoons? Ten. Hmm. Swift SRM pod. Hmm. Hammer pod. Well, I think we'll stick a hammer pod there. And a hammer pod there. And then a harpoon. Here. I think we just need to get this up. Flux dissipation rate. Maybe do that yeah that seems reasonable all right we do have our two uh, Velas to to help with the flux problems so that's kind of nice but that is our ships oh we're missing the small missile turrets Dang it. I'm considering not putting those on Or let's these two fervors. What can we do that is a bit cheaper? Mm. Firebird bombers, Eon bombers. You know what, we're going to put broadswords on. That gives us 14. We have six. So that would be what? So four is too many because that's 24. What if we... Do this, and we have 24. And I'm actually considering doing refills. Or maybe annihilators. Or Atropos. Atropos might be nice. <sighs> hmm. 
Let's do a couple of atroposes. And Raphael's. Or Raphael, or however you pronounce it. And I don't really care about the groups because I am not going to be flying this ship. This is going to be piloted by one of our guys. But that takes us up to max. And we can put you up here. Bang. And we can put you up here. Bang. Uh, I think... I'll actually do this because I always want uh, Ceres Villa deployed, I think. I think that's prudent. All right. So that's ship outfitting. And that's also the episode. That took a long time to get those fitted out properly. Hopefully properly. We don't know yet. Well, I don't. Maybe you do. If you know that it's not fitted out properly, let me know. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.